Hi guys, welcome to the Baby Alive channel. Would you like to learn how to make this Halloween costume for your Baby Alive doll? This is my baby all gone. Her name is Pumpkin and she wants to be a superhero for Halloween. Look at her headband. She's got an awesome cape. Look at her wristbands. This costume is so easy to make. I can show you how. The things you will need are pink and yellow felt. The size of this felt is eight inches by 12 inches. Scissors and Velcro. I love this Velcro because it's like a sticker. You just peel off the back and it sticks. There's no need for glue. Let's get started. Remember, never use anything sharp like scissors without an adult's permission. From here to here is about two inches and I'm gonna cut it straight across. Next, make another cut, only make it one, about one inch. This one's two inches, make this one about one inch. About like that. I've got my one inch and my two inch. Let's first work with the headband. Let's cut about that much, the Velcro, and cut the same amount. You can just place this Velcro on top. So you can cut the same amount. And the cool thing about felt is it stretches a little bit if you need it to be a little bit bigger because this barely fits around her forehead, but I can stretch it just a little bit. See so like that. Take the paper off the Velcro and place one on one end. And then you're going to bring it around like this. So you'll want to put the other here so you can do this. Okay. And then just match it up. So you'd want to put this one on the inside. So if you were to lay it out, you would see one piece of Velcro on this side and the other on that side. So when you match it up, it works. Okay. So now let's take our sweet little baby. Put it on her forehead, see if you like how it looks from the front. Oh, cute! Okay, and just match up the back. Now, take the other pink strip. This is the skinnier one of the two. Fit it around her wrist. Wrap it around. See, and I can tell I need to cut it right here. So you've got your two wristbands. Let's cut Velcro for them. It doesn't have to be a very big piece at all. And then match it up with the other Velcro. And this will work the same way. Put one right there, one right there, and then flip it over. Put Velcro on the opposite end. So you've got this Velcro right here and Velcro right here. Flip this over. Okay, let's see if it fits her. Oh my goodness. Look. That is so cute. Perfect. Look how cute. <laughs> and I'll cut out little yellow diamonds for the wrist. La, la, la. Doesn't she look like she's going to go exercise, maybe play tennis or go on a jog? So she needs her cape and she needs a star right here and diamonds on each wrist. She looks really cute though. Take your leftover piece of felt, fold it down about an inch, drape it over your doll, and look. That's how she'll look from the back. Okay, cut two pieces of Velcro so you can attach the cape on her. So you'll put one piece of the Velcro right here on one end and then the other piece just flip that corner over. Oops, take the sticky off and put the Velcro right there. So it's just like the wristband and the headband. You can see one piece of the Velcro and the other part is on the other side. And just turn her around. And look. Just match up the Velcro. Okay, now take your yellow piece of felt and cut out a star with paper. Use this as your pattern. And I'm not very good at cutting out stars, so what I did is I took my cell phone and Googled an image of a star, and then I placed a piece of paper over my phone and just traced it.
Okay, there's my star. That's a pretty good star, what do you think? Okay, and then just cut two very little pieces of Velcro. Just put one piece of Velcro on the back of the star and one piece on the back of the cape wherever you'd like to place your star and just match it up. Doesn't that look adorable? Okay, I've cut out the second star and I put Velcro on the headband and on the back of the star. So just match them up. <gasps> look at that, that's adorable. And the last thing we'll do is to cut out two little diamonds to put on her wrist. I'll make a cut here and then another one right here. And then when you open it up, it should look like a diamond. Perfect. And then I'll make one more. I'll draw half of a triangle like this. See my triangle? Make one cut this way and one cut this way. It should look like a diamond. And it does! Yay! One other thing I'd like to do, I'm going to make the end of her cape scallop. You do not need to do this, of course. But I'm going to make little cuts like this all along the bottom. Oh, that's so cute. I love it. If you like this costume, in the comments, type the words super hero girl. That way I will know that you'd like to see more costumes. I have a couple other costumes I'd like to show you. So if you like this video, please give us a thumbs up, share this video with your friends, and subscribe. And we'll make more. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.